see you, man. All right. Hey, what's up, man? What's up to the fans in Ghana? How are you know I'm representing Ghana? How was training? Oh, it was great. Okay. Another day in a bank. Yeah, here there, man. Manager. Kemi Olua. Yeah, you know her. I have the name, but I don't really know her in person, you know. But okay. they all know me. Okay, yeah. She she's so so she wants to uh, she wants is she sounding like she wants to go to Ghana to start her pro career. I, I'm trying to give her. I don't know what what advice could you give some give someone like that. How does she get to Ghana and start like you know do what you did? Um, the thing is that for me, I never travel without somebody giving me sending me invitation. Mm. I never, I didn't just start up a part my thing and start traveling to the country. I don't know. That is what I never think about doing all my life. Mm. You understand? Without the coaches over there calling me, Helen, come over, I can never go to Ghana. So I don't know how you will feel or how she will feel by the time she have no parent, no friend. She just pack her thing and go to a country. She have nobody. I don't know how she's going to survive. Hmm. Oh, no, you understand? We, yeah, uh -huh, I got you. A lot of people make that trip, but I really never think about doing that trip, not even for one day. Hmm. You got yeah. connections in Ghana, you can help her because she's a very good, determined girl, as hmm. I heard about her. Hmm. You understand? Hmm. So she just needs a good help. And uh, the thing I have to advise her that everything in life is you have to cool down. You don't need to rush because you see, you can't do what I do because you don't belong to where I belong. Mm. Your destiny are not my destiny. So don't say because Helene go to so some place and make it. If I go there, you make it. It may not belong to that country. Mm. You understand? So only my advice that whatever they are doing, let them take time. Prayer, pray to God, ask God if this I'm doing, um, is that the right thing to do? Is that where I belong? Don't just do something because we have no power to do anything. It's only God's direction that will lead us through. You have to make sure you pray to God because he is the final saying. Mm. He got the final word. When he said go, you go. If he said don't go, don't go. So ask for favor from him all the time. That is what I need to tell them. To cool down. Don't just joke because most of us make mistakes today. We sign a contract because you want to travel. We are under bondage right now. Yeah. We don't even know how to get out from the contract because we all are desperate to travel. But we don't even know where we are going. Mm, no, we no don't plan. even know where we are going to face. Right. I tell you, we start crying. Had I know, I could have still be, keep staying where I was before. It's better than here now. Right. But we don't think that when we want to travel, we always take one way. Yeah. Most of my boys today are crying here because they don't have way out. Most of them forced to betray their wife at home and get married because they want freedom. Yeah, but if you don't know, you, oh, she's so this guy is wicked. He abandoned the children and the wife. He get married because he need to survive. He need to be free because even though you left this country and go Africa, that contract follow you to Africa. Mm -hmm. So then they just need to cool down. They yeah. just need to cool down and move slowly and think about what they are doing. If not, when they get into problem in contract, whenever you sign contract, contract is like a death warrant. Mm -hmm. You don't even know how to get out from it. If it if you sign, you sign. Yeah.